Hi, I'm Brittany, and this is BA Beauty. And today I brought my incredibly awkward friend, Kate, <laughs> so we can do <laughs> a special Mommy Monday where I can show you how to use some of the products that I've shown you to look more awake. Not like this. All right, here we go. We're using the Rainforest of the Sea and Light and Neutral and my Real Techniques Beauty Blender. And we're just gonna dot it onto the face and blend it out. Now the key here is really to just, you know, beat the face. Really just get it in there, do what you gotta do. And I'm just gonna dot some more on because she needed a little more coverage today. Um, normally I would not put this much on her, but she was having an allergic reaction. Otherwise her skin is really beautiful. But yeah, we're just gonna bring it down the neck and blend it in. The foundation was a little dark for today, but we're gonna make it work. Here is the Tarte Shape Tape in Fair Neutral. I'm going to dot it on the under eyes and a little bit on the lid as a primer and just one little dot on the nose. And here we're going to use the Light Neutral. I just didn't want her to get too light under the eyes. I want it to still look natural but have a brightening effect. So this is really going to work well to look away, cancel out that redness, and just look really natural and beautiful. And now it's just blending time. Just roll your sponge over a little bit and use a cleaner side to blend out the concealer gently down the nose, under the eyes, and on the eyelids. I am going to add a little extra to the under the nose area just because that redness from the allergy is showing up there a little stubbornly. So let's blend that in and get rid of it. And here she is after all the foundation and concealer is all blended out. Good dance moves, Kate. Here we're going to use the Tarte Smooth Operator Amazonian Clay Tinted Pressed Finishing Powder in Light. Did you get all that? The brush I'm using is the Morphe E31. It's just a flat top kabuki brush and I love to use it for my powder foundations. Now I'm just going to use NARS Laguna Bronzing Powder to warm up the face. I like to put it on the cheekbones and on the forehead, maybe a little bit on the jawline and bring it down the neck. Just really want her to look warm, wake, ready to go. I really like this Dirty Little Secrets blush and it is a matte blush in the color Kitty Pink. It's adorable and I am going to use the Morphe Gold Collection brush in Y1. Use a light hand with the blush. Um, I recommend always working your way up if you need more pigmentation. And look at that face. And just start with the apples of the cheeks so that way you get that nice rosy look. And then we're going to go on to Mary Luminizer by The Balm. Oh my goodness, this just makes every look perfection. And I'm using the Morphe E5 fan brush and it's really big and fluffy so we can get a really nice diffused glow. And this is just a large, fluffy, blending brush. And I really like this to just use this in the crease. And it is from the set 702 12-piece Eye Credible Set from Morphe. And I also just took the NARS Laguna Bronzing Powder in the crease. That way we used less products, because I think on an everyday look, less is more. We're going to use some MAC Fix Plus and just this little pencil brush and we're going to dip it into my Mary Luminizer to brighten up the inner corners of the eye. Just swiping Mary Luminizer over the lid and down the center of the nose. Oh 
All right, and this is the finished look. We did add a little extra because our girl Kate is a little extra herself. We uh, added the Stila um, liquid metal eyeshadow because like I said, extra. But we wouldn't do that in just your everyday dropping the kids off for, to school. I mean, I would, but the average mom probably wouldn't. And we just darkened up her eyebrows a little bit. And ow, ow. time for the Tigra. <laughs> we steal. I turned left. Shows that and we added the highlight just to make her look nice and awake and glowy and be like, oh, I woke up this way. Let's go this I way. I wake up awesome. We can pretend. <laughs> Alright, so we really we just focused on the complexion to cancel out some redness. She did have an allergy, so she had a lot of redness under the eyes. And plus she's ginger and soulless. So we really had a lot of work cut out for us today. But with the help of our friend Tarte Shape Tape, it really helped to cancel out the redness. And um, I really, just for the everyday eye look, wow, professionals I work with, <laughs> we actually just warmed up the crease with the Laguna Bronzer by NARS. Put the highlighter in here just to help with the, make the eyes bigger and more awake because she's just lazy as <laughs> <laughs> and she's always sleeping on the job. I, mean, I don't know how she has a job. Stop <laughs> using my shelf! <laughs> Alright, but yeah, the focus of this look was just to look awake. And we did use the Maybelline Baby Lips on the lips because she just wanted to hydrate those lips. And who doesn't want a nice, shiny, glossy lip in the morning? And a pop of color. And a pop of color. <laughs> But that's really the it. The look was really simple. I know she could do it on her own if she actually tried. <laughs> do the La Tigra. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, but that's all for our video today. And please like and subscribe to our channel. And we'll see you later. Bye. Oh my god, how am I still friends with her? <laughs>